Greetings and welcome to Train Station Simulator. In the previous episode, we put all the things on the side of the track here. We put the bathroom at the end. We moved the timetables around after realizing we've been doing them wrong the entire time because we actually should be paying attention to the departure times and not the arrival times. Uh, we also found out it takes approximately two hours for these lazy people to walk from there to there. Yeah. So because they have to come up here, go up there, go up there, get their ticket and go back that way, we put these little bank of uh, ticket machines here for them. And being on the inside, they don't seem to get vandalized, at least for day one they don't get vandalized. Anyway, maximum passenger reach waiting to clear. What? We have maximum number of passengers in the station? <gasps> We've maxed out the game's uh, limit of number of passengers we can have. Cool. I didn't think there was something we could do. Anyway, well, that's working on. Uh, we were planning today to build a brand new train track. Boop. Train track all the way down to there. Yes. Now, if we do it again. Not enough money. I spent all the money when that one drank. We had like 100k. Pop the buffer on the end. Boop. So not break everything. There we go. And we have plenty of excess. We could actually bring the track became further if we wanted to. I still feel like it. Uh, I feel like where the eye is good, we can actually have some stuff at this end. Lure people down this end of the station, which would be kind of a nice idea. Whoa. We, need, we have so many people in right now. We need more janitors during the daytime. 7pm. Janitor. Hire you. You need to work until 8. Uh, you'll be paid 200 like everyone else. And you'll start at 10 a.m. till 8 p.m. You know what? Not, I want you to work till 10. There we go. Noon till 10. We just need a lot of staff on this time of day. It's really busy. We need cleaners. Um, we usually should have more security guards in. I feel like we just don't have enough. So if we run you from midnight to. Ooh, no, not that far down. 3 p.m. Uh, and we run you from 3 p.m. to midnight. And then we take that, that comes forward a bit until. Really? You don't want to. Wow. You really don't want to work, do you? Alright, well, you get to work from 3 p.m. No, two. If, what's about it? There you go. And you get to pay 200 as well. Uh, pay up for you. No, no, pay up for you. You, you'd be so happy. Uh, that's good. Okay, uh, you, we have midnight to noon and noon to midnight. We have a constant supply of repair people. You repair people? Okay, you could workers. Medical personnel, 1 till 8, 7 to 5. Let's go and reschedule you guys. So 7 till 5, 1 till 8. Uh, so if we then say from you, we want you to run till midnight. Attention, please. This till. Is yeah, that'll do fine. If 200 any suspicious activity and then we'll run you midnight to basically there 9 a.m 9 a.m 10 a.m 10 a.m so yeah that's a nice overlap there so it's nice overlaps and being our way down to everybody else's done cleaners are at maximum and we only have one cargo manager which we don't use because we don't have cargo at the moment but there we go that's all of our cash running we might need to redo all of our times with our, our, uh, our cleaners because I think they're a bit over the all over the place. Yeah. They just can't keep up with that demand. That's the problem. I mean, they're Attention, there. Please. Trying. The passenger terminal will be closing in 30 minutes. The terminal will reopen at 5 a.m. Thank you. Okay. Pause for a moment. Facilities, not facilities, employees, cleaners. Right, let's start with this. I want everyone to start at midnight so I, have, I can play with stuff. Now, we won't be needing people at midnight. That's the thing. Because, quite frankly, no one is in the place until 7.30. But it clearly says that the place opens at 7.30. So doing this is useless to us. Right. So the first person will work midnight until until 1 p.m. Right? Now that's that's fine. You will only start to 1 p.m. Now the next person will start at 7 when we know the station opens and you'll work until 
I would like you to work, not be too thing, but you do like. There we go. You'll work till two p.m. That's fine. And then we get a busy period at the end of the day. Now, at the end of the day, I want one person working till midnight. So, if you're working till midnight, what's the earliest you can start and they'll be happy? 10, 11 a.m. So, we can actually have you there. Now, we have the station up until 10. Uh, so, let's put these just so we can get these sort of lined up. If we have the station up until 10 p.m., maximum number of janitors in place. Make this place. Can I have a sound back on, please? Uh, make sure this place is prepped and ready, okay? So, 10. And 10. Right, now, you're going to be there till 10. So, if we set you going, what time can you start work? There. 9 a.m. And you? 9 a.m. And you? Would you also be 9 a.m. by any chance? Oh, it's looking like it could be really useful to us. If we have just a couple overnight. Yeah, we can have a mo we have loads of loads of janitors running during the main daytime. There we go, and you as well. You're you you don't, you're not as happy as working. You're working till noon from noon. So we have one person working early morning, <clears throat> and we have one person working late, and everybody else works the main day. Yeah, and that. That means we have loads of coverage for, for people during the uh, rush hour, between 9am and 10pm, where most people are. Now, there is some dirt around right now, but hopefully that will mean they can keep up on top of that. In fact, you know what we can do? We take through forward one hour each. And put this to 11. And then they've got like, a little extra slot right there. That hopefully will uh, will do us. Hopefully will do us. We'll find out today when everyone gets there and does their stuff. Right, everyone can leave where we can get this place cleaned up. And we'll uh, we'll move on. Ba, ba, ba. The one lonely cleaner right there, because all the dirt of all the people. He's going to be there busy right up until midnight. Ba, ba, there he goes. And then the next person's going to start there they are, and take over what he didn't get clean. And then there's more for you to do right there. Yep. And then at uh, at 9 a.m. There'll be a massive flux of people running into this building, just cleaning all the stuff and keeping it clean. That's the plan. Whether it'll work or not, that's a different thing entirely. Bear, bear. Right, let's watch up here. This is our staff right now. Attention, please. Six. Smoking is not allowed. Seven. Time. Thank you. Eight. Come on, eight. There's a lot of people in there right now. One the cleaner, keeping everything going. And then suddenly, oop, oh, lag. And then. Nine o'clock. Did I say ten o'clock? I better do ten o'clock, didn't I? Ten o'clock. Well, they're on duty. We just they just magically appear somewhere else instead. That's fine by me. Uh, there we go. Everybody on. Everybody in. Everybody do their thing. Everybody on. Everybody in. Everyone do their thing. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, we have money. I forgot about that. We have money today. Uh, let's build up this side of the track. It's going to cost us a bit of money to get it done, so we might as well do it properly. Uh, I can't see that. There we go. Right, and that goes all the way down to there. Boop. And then the other side, because why would you not do both sides? Boop. Thank you. That took a lot of money, but not all of it, funnily enough. Clear that. Uh, clear objects. Clear that machine, and 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 that machine. Okay, build flooring. Uh, build that floor all the way down to there, and that give us something to work with. But most importantly, we need to put those uh, machines back in place. So we want the ah no my objects. We want the information kiosk there. That one can go away. The clock tower thingy can go there. Uh, we can then put up a stack of these machines here. One, two, three. One, two, three. That should do quite nicely as six machines. Should do them quite nicely there. Then we want to make sure this is a nice place for benches. Like that. Attention, please. This is a safety announcement. If you see any suspicious activity or unattended luggage, notify the station personnel. 
Thank you. Yes, please, please do notify the station personnel if you see anything that's potentially uh, explosive or dangerous. Uh, I didn't say explosive, I, I said uh, annoying or... Um, yeah, things explode. Uh, coffee, 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 coffee. We don't have a coffee place. There, the coffee place. Ba, ba, ba. There we go, a nice little, uh, nice little coffee place there. I want to put down a building here. Now, do we have the facilities here? I would love to put down a lounge, not a lounge bar, a food station out here. Just randomly in the middle of nowhere, we can sit down and have, a, have some food. Um, are this back in the set? Yeah, right there. Boop. One, one right there. Um, we don't need anything else here. Ooh, we do an underpass. Uh, right there. Right, so the thing about this is we can then come along with our benches. Like that. Uh, put down the clock tower there. So I don't forget where it's going to be. And we can put down bins. There. Oh, not there. 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 We can put the flowers nowhere. There you go. Boom, boom, flowers there. Boom, boom. Not enough money. Can't afford the flowers. Okay. Well, I think we got the important part here done, so we're good. Stop flashing out. Oh, I figured it out. Uh, but there we go. We have people here, people there, people there, people there. Good. I think that will work out nicely for us. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. <clears throat> and these, hopefully this will draw people up this side of the station as well. We can put another restroom up here at some point. Yeah, that should do it. Matching to passengers reach, waiting to clear. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba Yeah, we have a lot more people here now. We're pulling them out of the station itself into this area, which is getting a lot more people onto that train. Wow, that is a lot of people getting onto that train. Attention, please. This is a safety announcement. If Ooh, 9 p.m. Suspicious activity or unattended luggage. Okay, I think the I think the cleaners did their job really well today. Now, there's still a lot of people here, and there's only one cleaner on duty right now. Well, there were maybe three, and then now there's only one. But I think that's good because they are leaving and that one person the passenger is passenger terminal will be closing in 30 minutes. The terminal will reopen at 5 a.m. Thank okay. you. Okay. New timetable. New timetable. Why can't we... What? Why can't we have these? They're not long drains. Have we lost contracts? Okay. Well, we'll take that one. Uh, no, we'll take you on that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Um, I'm confused why we can't do this. Why do we not have these? It's only two. It's only three. It's only two. We can we can handle those. Huh? Give me a moment to reload the save just in case it bugged out. No. Okay. Um. We're actually not allowed these. Oh, they have a, a different type of track on the ones we're not allowed to do. Do they need a fancy station or something? Um, is that a new thing they need? Because that's like normal, and that's that, and all of ours are these. What would that be? What would that be? Is that like electrified lines or something? Let's have a quick look at our um, build. Oh, advanced. We have we have the option to build this new new advanced. Oh, right. We need to start looking at those. They weren't there before. They come, just coming through 1980 or something? Probably. Can we upgrade one of our stations then? I mean, this is a brand new one here. But it would make sense to upgrade one of our stations to this new advanced special type of stuff. Uh, it costs... Track up data. Perfect. It costs us... That and that. It will cost us. Price needs calculation. Oh, uh, click. Select and go. Oh, we uh, can do it at the. Uh. Where do you do it? Where? Where? Where do? You, where do you press? Hang on. They say where the buffer is. Maybe. Uh, track data. Press. Ah, for track types. Oh, okay. We need 150, we can do that. 
Okay, we'll upgrade we, you know, we'll we that track in the middle. Boom. Super special high speed trail. It's not high speed rail, it's got. It, they've literally put bricks down there and they, they've filled in the, uh, the the coal with. Yeah, okay. Alright, timetables. Right, so undo that, undo that, undo that. Right, so we have track two is capable of doing these. And it can't do the other ones. Oh, that's interesting. It physically cannot do the other type. Uh, okay. Um, track 2 is upgraded, so it can't do the old type for some reason. It's not even capable, which is kind of weird. But anyway, that means track 1. Commuters. There. National. Commuter. CityLink. You know what? CityLink goes in there. CityLink. Commuters. And that one requires a special type of thing. Okay. That's all the ones we can get. We just, just can't get the last one because there's just, unfortunately, that one there. They leave it at 9 and they rev at 8. Alright, so back to the piece of paper. Alright, so commuters coming uh, are leaving at 7, 10, 1, 5, 6, and 10. City links are leaving at 6, 8, 10. Um, <clears throat> and Nationals at 4, 9, ba -ba -ba, and that's it, okay. Okay, so to the transit. Right, so back to the post-it note. Commuters are at 7, so we want you to have the, those two slots. And then you have a 10, so you need that one and that one. Uh, and then you have a 1, so you need that one and that one. You know, we'll just leave the one that's available right now. Um, and then you get 5, so you want that one. And then you get a 6, so you're going to want that one. Uh, and you need a 10, so you're going to want that one. The city links have a six, so screw you. Uh, no, they can have that one. They can have the five. They can use it for the seven, so they can have five for the six. They might not get there in time. That's a problem. Uh, you have an eight, so you can have the seven slot, and then you have a a one. You have the ten slot, and then we just fill the gaps basically. Um, have that one, have that one, have that one, and that one, and that one, and that one, and that one. There's no point putting any of these because the the nationals don't have anything. Uh, so things don't have anything after one o'clock anyway. All right, buses. I wish these would reset as well though with the uh, train line so we could do these much quicker. All right, we're in number two. The I just check something. I'm pretty sure I've missed it one of my time. My first city link is 6 p.m. Did I put in as an a.m. over here? Uh, I did put in as an a.m. Nope, it's a p.m. The first thing is 6 p.m. So undo you. Your first thing is 6 p.m. So right, your first one's at 6 p.m. So you get the five there. Then you have an eight. And then you have. And the 10 there, so you, have, so you have a 6 and an 8. And I wrote down 10 even though we're not actually picking that one up. That's what screwed me over with that one. Okay. Ignore that 10. So, <clears throat> you need a 6 and 8. You don't know them, so you get that one and that one. Uh, you you also have a 6 p.m. The 5 foot will be useless to you, but we do have a 10 for you. Um, we could do with giving you the 7 slot, but no. You really need it for your eight. So we take that and take that. You get that slot. Oh, yeah, you have that slot. You can have that slot. You can have that slot. That one. And that one. There's literally nothing the reason for you to have anything. You can just have those for your six o'clock pickup and your eight o'clock pickup. Yeah, that should do it. That should. You know what? Boom. You have a four thirty as well. That should bring you guys in nice and early. And then we're on you. Okay, <clears throat> let's do a sitting first this time round. 
So your six and eight are your only times you need to be anyone around. So you need a six and an eight. So we give you the six, five, and five. Give you that block there. So you have people coming in at five. People coming in at four for your six o'clock. People coming in at five for your set for your eight o'clock. Uh, yeah, that should be enough to get you through. Now we might have to move those around, but that's just a that's a little block for you guys. All right. So uh, the first one we have is well, actually the nationals only got four and nine. Um, so you have the two and the seven, eight, if you want them. Yeah, you have the seven. Okay. Which means the commuter gets the eight ready for the ten, which makes sense. And it needs a seven, a ten, a one. It doesn't get any from five and six though, because you're grabbing them. You know what? I'll give you that. You get all these. You can have all the morning ones for the commuters. There we go. And at the end of the day, you don't let the computers have more buses. There's no reason for it, but let them have them anyway. <clears throat> okay. We are good on transit. Let's uh, unpause. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Go away. All right. So we have a lot of people just... I wish it wouldn't just magically disappear. Da -da -da. We should start walking away. There's no reason for being in the station, basically, unless they want to have food or waiting for a train. If there's no trains coming, because we have no trains after the point, just be there. Anyway, we've now done all the train setup, we've done the timetable setup, we've done the city transit. I think we are good. So, we'll wait for the next day to start. Let me know what you think of the game, what you think of the episode, and what you think of the series in general. And until next time, comments in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>